it's Madame Hills here again from Tim and Centennial. Um, so today we're going to be doing another read aloud of a story that um, most of these Centennial students who are probably familiar with um, learning in kindergarten is the uh, Tucker the Turtle story. So it is called Tucker the Turtle Takes Time to Tuck and Think. It is a scripted story to assist with teaching the turtle technique by Rochelle Lentini. Tucker the turtle is a terrific turtle. He likes to play with his friends at Wet Lake School. Tucker loves to play ball with Crocodile and Ducky. Ouch! Tucker got hit by the ball. Tucker now feels angry. Ooh. I think I want Can you show me what your angry faces look like? Ooh, that's an angry face. When Tucker used to get mad, he would hit, kick, or yell at his friends. And his friends would feel very sad when Tucker would hit, kick, or yell. Can you show me what your sad face looks like? Now, Tucker thinks like a turtle. When he is angry, he stops and thinks. So what he does is he will tuck inside his shell and take three deep breaths. So in through your nose, out through your mouth for three breaths. One, two, three. So you can practice this um, by pretending that you have a shell and you can tuck inside like this and do your three deep breaths as well. So then Tucker can think of a solution or a way to make it better. So what are some ways that we can solve a problem? We could get a teacher. We could ask nicely. We can use our words. We can ignore. We can say, please stop. We can share, trade a toy, or wait and take a turn. Tucker's friends are happy when he plays nicely. Friends like it when Tucker keeps his body to himself and uses nice words. The end. So now I am challenging you to practice this technique at home. Whenever you are feeling angry or upset like our friend Tucker, I want you to tuck inside your shell and take three deep breaths. If after you've taken your three deep breaths, you're still maybe feeling a little bit angry or upset, you can take three more. It's fine if you need to stay in your shell longer. Once you feel like you're calmed down, then you can come out of your shell and try to think of a way to solve your problem. Maybe you're angry because um, your brother or sister doesn't want to share a toy with you. Um, you can try to talk to them, try to explain to them how you're feeling, try to make a compromise, wait and take a turn, trade a toy, um, try to think of any of the ways to problem solve whatever problem you have. Some problems we might need an adult's help with um, and there's a lot of problems that we can solve on our own. But the first step that you need to do is you need to make sure to calm your body down first because it's very difficult to think clearly and to solve problems when we're feeling very angry or upset. So I am challenging you all to think like Tucker the turtle and tuck inside your shells when you are feeling angry or upset. Take three deep breaths and try to think of a way to solve your problem. Bye for now.